Cool, and here we are at the meat and potatoes of the of the site. Our uh, our source tracking. This is where we're going to view the results of all your advertising efforts so far. It's sorted by uh, by views when you first look at it. The one that have had the most views at the top, least at the bottom. You have the the source first thing on the left. This would be the the traffic exchange, the uh, the safe list maybe. If you're using social media, it'll say like Facebook or Google or um, Twitter, whatever you're using. Like I have a couple of safe lists on here too. Uh, direct links would be like if you if I put this link in in Skype or if I sent it to you in email and you use the email client, you know, it just opened the web browser window. That would be a direct direct link. Uh, next, we can see how many views that that source has received. Uh, the first one right on top here, the source 24-7 Traffic Pro. I can see under views that it has been viewed 2,487 times. I can see under clicks that it has been clicked twice. And I can see under goals that I've had one goal. I've gotten one sign up. Pretty excited about that. We also have our percentages. Uh, some people love percentages. I know I do personally. I'll click this little arrow to sort the percentage. That gives me a better idea because, um, like, here, Viral Nugget, I've had three clicks. But Jungle Clicks Pro, I've had one click. You know, but really, I saw 11 views versus 54 views. So that's, uh, that's 9%. Granted, 11 views isn't enough to know, you know, if if it's really going to stay that way. But I can see that for the information I have gathered, that it's giving me good results as far as people clicking on my page. I'll do that again by goals. Maybe the most important to me is the, the sign up. I can see fast, easy traffic, you know, 0.32% that have seen my page, have signed up at 24-7 Traffic Pro, 0.04% that I've seen my page have signed up. Uh, the last column here, which is, for me, the most important one, is the reach. That's pretty much, that's essentially how much of that market you're reaching. Uh, a couple of the most important things in advertising are reach and frequency. How many people see your page and how often they see your page. So for fast, easy traffic, which is right here, I have 3% uh, reach. Means I have reached 167. Oops, if I mouse over it here. 167 of their 5,320 active members. That's active within the last uh, 90 days that I've tracked the unique IP addresses. And I see since that's 167 people and I've gotten 310 views, each person has seen my page about, about twice. Uh, my goal, of course, is to get 100% reach. I want everybody in the traffic exchange to see my page. And I want them all to see it 100 times. And so I might want 100,000 views you know, the 100% reach. That's 5,000 people, so I would want, you know, 500,000 views. But we start, start small. You know, we can sort our reach and see, you know, where we're getting a lot of coverage and where we're, where we're not getting much coverage at all. Like at Top Hits for You, I've only reached half a percent. So I'll probably want to buy some credits there, do some surfing, you know, increase that number. Whereas, uh, you know, lobby hits have gotten 5%. Uh, it's still not very much. You know, that's only 46 out of 800 people. So I, I need to actually focus there, too. I need to focus on all of these. But what I like to do is sort this from the least up. You know, and start there. Easy hits for you, 0.003%. I obviously need to get some more advertising going on there. It's so far 0.1%. I 
Uh, obviously, you need to get some more advertising there. So these are my biggest priorities, the ones with the least amount of reach, because there's a lot of, there's a huge opportunity there that I haven't um, taken advantage of, and that's a lot of a lot of viewers that, you know, aren't seeing my site, that haven't seen my site, haven't been exposed to my products. You know, that's a big market that I haven't touched. So that's my personal big focus, my marketing strategy. Um, you may want to focus on what's providing you the most amount of goals. Uh, you, another person might want to focus on what's providing the most amount of clicks. Uh, you might just care about page views. Maybe you want to view, you know, whatever has the most amount of views. Uh, it's totally up to you to use this data that, in a way that helps you maximize your advertising, which is why it's here and why we have these kind of sites. Uh, right now, we're viewing the top 25. Let's say we only wanted to see the top five. Down at the bottom, we have a little next to the search box. It says show. Let's say show. Let's uh, we'll just show five sites. Show five. Click update here. And now you see we just have my top five. Let's say you want to show uh, 100. Show 100. Update. Then you have the top 100. Let's say I was trying to find a, a certain site. I couldn't find, I can't see Fox Hits anywhere. So I'll, I'll type Fox Hits because that's what I'm searching for. Click Search Sources. Oh no, look, there it is. Had 28 views, uh, no clicks or goals yet, compared to my total of 13 clicks. In total, two goals. Um, I reached 2% of the people, somewhere I might want to advertise more. Uh, if you're if you're a graph person, uh, I don't use the graphs a whole lot, but I know a lot of people really like them. So I have some graphs up here too. You can view the traffic you've gotten in the last 24 hours by hour, 12 a.m., 1 a.m., 2 a.m., 3 a.m. Uh, this solid straight line here is your median. On average, I'm getting two page views per hour to this splash page. Uh, like at 10 a.m., I got five. You know, but 11, 11 a.m., I only got one. Uh, so just kind of averages out. We have the same style of graph for, uh, for your 30-day data. You can see there are a few days that I promoted this a lot. But then I toned it down and just kind of put it in, mixed it in with my other stuff. Nor uh, a last 12 month, if you want to see the whole last year. This site, so this site has only been in there for a couple months, so I'm only showing you know, the last two months here. And again, with the blue line being the average. And that is the tracking data on how to read it. If you If you have any questions about any of this stuff, or you get kind of confused, or want to get a hold of me, just click the support button on top. I'll be happy to help you out. I want to make this site work for you, you know, so you can achieve your goals and, and become successful. I want you to be able to track your results so that you're getting the best advertising you can get, you know, maximizing your time and money, your resources. So just click the, the support button, you know, and I'd love to help you out, answer any questions you have. Uh, but that's about it for the source tracking. Uh, the next thing you might want to do is uh, look at the rotators. Um, that's, rotators are awesome if you like to advertise in traffic exchanges or if you're trying to trying to split test a series of pages. Then uh, a rotator is really what you're looking for. If you click on the uh, set rotator under the rotator menu, I'll have a video waiting for you there. Um, if you'd like to do that now, I will see you there.